digital immortality. Yeah, you heard that right. Living forever, but in a digital format. Intrigued yet? Let's jump right in. So, what is digital immortality? In a nutshell, it's the idea of preserving your consciousness, memories, personality, and identity in a digital format. Imagine being able to live forever in a virtual environment. Sounds like science fiction, right? Well, it might be closer to reality than you think. There are a few approaches to this. Now, let's break it down. First up, we have mind uploading. This involves scanning and mapping the brain's neural structure to create a digital copy of your mind. Basically, it's like downloading yourself into a computer or a robot. You'd retain your thoughts, memories, and personality. Next, we have virtual reality avatars. These are avatars in virtual environments that can interact with others just like you would based on your data, preferences, and historical behaviors. It's like creating a mini you that can live on in the digital world. Then there's AI simulations. Using AI to analyze your digital footprint, think social media, emails, writings. These simulations can mimic your behavior and responses. So even after you're gone, it can feel like people are still interacting with you. Then we have digital legacies, which if you ask me is the least creepy among them all. This is all about maintaining extensive digital records like photos, videos, and writings organized in a way that allows future generations to experience aspects of your life and personality. It's like leaving behind a digital time capsule. Now, let's talk about what's the tech behind it. What's actually making all this possible? Neuro, prosthetics, and brain-computer interfaces, BCIs. These bad boys are crucial for understanding and interfacing with the brain. Neuroprosthetics are devices that can replace or enhance the function of a damaged nervous system, while BCIs allow direct communication between the brain and external devices, paving the way for mind uploading. We're talking serious sci-fi stuff here. Machine learning and AI. Advanced AI algorithms are getting really good at simulating human conversation and behavior, perfect for creating those convincing digital personas. Virtual and augmented reality. VR and AR provide immersive environments where digital avatars can interact with real people in real time. It's like the ultimate crossover episode. And now, ethical and philosophical considerations. But it's not all fun and games. There are some deep ethical and philosophical questions that we all need to consider. Identity and continuity. Does a digital copy truly represent the original person? Or is it just a sophisticated simulation? Heavy stuff to think about, right? Privacy and consent. And what about privacy and consent, especially after someone's death? Who decides if a digital copy should exist, especially if there's no will explicitly leaving one? Impact on society. The potential impact on society is profound. How will interacting with digital versions of deceased individuals change our understanding of life, death, and legacy? In conclusion, Digital immortality is still largely theoretical, but with advancements in neuroscience, AI, digital technology, who knows what the future holds? One thing is for sure, it's an exciting time to be alive. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated with the latest in AI and digital tech, make sure to like, subscribe, and share. And hey, drop a comment below. We would love to hear. Would you like to live forever digitally? Until next time. Stay curious.